Today you will watch us pour the concrete into the green bin house. This is going to be the final floor that we'll actually use. We'll have a, a sealant put on it uh, later after some of the construction is done. You can see here the PEX was laid last week and now we're going to pour the concrete right on top of it. Um, you can see that video if you want a little bit more details from that. The link is above. This, this was a little bit trickier than pouring the pad. When you pour the pad and put the forms and everything, you're all outside. You're not limited to the space that you're working in. So I was pretty impressed when I watched how this was done. I, I was really curious um, how they were going to get that big truck over here and get that concrete poured into this condensed area. It, it wasn't easy, um, but they knocked it out. So you're going to see the video, the process that they go through. It was a lot of work. It took all day. And I do want to mention that we had a two-week delay before we were even able to pour the concrete. There was a lot of rain all of a sudden, and we just needed to have the weather conditions to be right. But here we are. You'll get to see them pouring the concrete. They kept maneuvering the truck um, chute so that they could get it in there. And of course, it's a lot of hard work. They had to uh, spread it out, make sure it was level, and then make sure it was smooth in the end. And at the end of the video, um, at the end of the day, after they left, my husband put a heater on it um, just to help it dry and cure faster um, because the temperature was really changing a lot. Um, so it probably wasn't the best conditions. You can see here where the tubes are sticking out. That's where the water is going to go in for the radiant heating. Once we install that, we'll have a whole video explaining the details on how that works as well. But today, enjoy the process. Watch how they level it. Watch how they smooth it out and get this big job done. Next week, we will be talking about uh, some of the behind the scenes things that are going on. You can see windows haven't been cut out yet. The doors have been, but I want to talk a little bit about that as well. And some of the process of what's going on behind the scenes as we're planning this and collecting ideas and materials.